See, they try to fool me. There's jewelry in here. You thought all the money was over, but no, 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 no. Look, she just found in what was it, a card, right? Ooh, is that Zale the diamond store bag? We're not gonna go into too much detail, but as you can see, that is the combination to, I am so excited to be back at this $1,000 storage unit. If you don't know why, here's a little clip of that. Let's go! Another hundred. <laughs> Look at all the money in there. Oh! Oh! oh. No. What, is that a bag? No. Yeah, wouldn't you be excited too? Let's go back in there and see what else we can find. Before we start going through this stuff, I gotta tell you a little something. We found something else in that safe that wasn't money, but it made me really excited, and we'll talk about that just a little bit later, but it's really good, trust me. Let's get down some boxes and start cutting them open. Let's just say it was a little bit of information on paperwork that could make something else in here really good. I'm not going to spoil that. If it's in here. But later, we will. Uh, a box in a box? Multifunction clothes dryer. What? That small? I got to see what it is. It's brand new, like everything else, weirdly. But yeah, I'm cutting it open. Uh, well, I mean, we'd have to take it out and see what it looked like. All right, but there it is. Like I said last time, that safe that we found everything in was in the box right there, still in the plastic. So anything that's new is kind of suspicious to me. Now I'm cutting it all open because I never know if there's a brand new convention oven with $3,000 inside of it. You never know no more. So everything is up for question. You wanna know something funny? You see the iPhone box we found last time? I left this out because originally I was like, that would make a cool thing to put in the thumbnail. But then, you know, the safe, the safe changed my mind. <laughs> Just a little bit. So let's get this big boy out. Whoa, another Lowe's box. Huh? Ugh, it's bleeding. bleeding. The box is bleeding. Save it. <laughs> it's bleeding. <laughs> uh, what if I just cut it and you just saw, saw it just start leaking like oh crazy? Oh my gosh. That'd be weird. Whoa, look what I see. Fine jewelry established 1902. Is there anything in there? Just a little bag. What's in this? Uh, it just says some weird stuff on it. Let's see what's in this tote though. Come on, what is it? Open. Uh, it looks like baking crafting stuff in this one from what I'm seeing. Yep. Yeah, quite a bit of it in there. And by the way, we move kind of fast through this stuff. If you want to see it like much more slow, go down in the description, click on our link to the second channel. We're going to put videos on that channel where we actually go into each individual item. This one we like to kind of pace going to make it faster, but over there, you'll see everything in more detail. Little silicone things. Ah, open. We needed those like just a couple months ago. I couldn't find them anywhere. Uh, that's what's leaking. Ah! Oh no! <laughs> oh, <laughs> gotta get that off my hand. Okay, it's like paint though. I, think I see it's that just thing. Like, it's food dye. It's food dye? That doesn't come off. <laughs> that stuff like stains forever. Great. Now I have like bluish, blackish fingertips. Great. And the rest of it, the only other thing in there is an envelope and a canvas. And you know what? We can't just say an envelope anymore. Right. <laughs> they all have to be open at this point. <clears throat> okay, now this is just paperwork, And we definitely have to check, like on the second channel, all the boxes. Everything, you never <laughs> that know. That we didn't check before we found yeah. these. My mom's coming here today because we're taking the filing cabinet out. Remember last time we found that a couple videos ago? We were like, yeah, it's just paper. No, we're taking every drawer out, ripping every envelope, looking under the drawers and everything. Nothing's getting out of this unit. Nothing. I was just going to toss this to the side, but then I noticed... Ah, some like holiday cards in here like this one it's still sealed we found money in these before very rarely it's like one out of i'd say what 200 cards you'll find anything in it but i think on the second channel i found one in like a baby shower card once yeah you never know how many chances did you find a safe full of money one in a million oh, yeah. like <laughs> so anything everything's up for question right now no just cards yeah and this is like tile okay this is weird okay yeah, the rest of it just dirty clothes Let's get out another Lowe's box right here. Unmarked. Do you see anything on that side? Nope. Lowe's. Never Lowe's. stop improving. All right. That's not marked. <laughs> Let's see what it is. <clears throat> is this paperwork? No, we haven't found paperwork in this unit yet, besides in a little bit in the safe. So you know what? We got to look and see what this is. Come out. Come out. Uh, certificate of Ministry. All right. That's like personal stuff. They'll get back. I'm just going to set it here. Uh, seeing papers, papers. Papers. Ooh, under the papers. It's not oh, all paper. Brand new stuff. What? Brand new stuff from this unit? No way. Whoa. Hey. Cool. <laughs> a little slice and dice set. Then what's that? A 110 pound scale. That's pretty cool. That is cool. We can use that for shipping. 
Paper cutter. There's like so much new stuff in here. What is that one? Portable Legacy. communion set. Okay. Some rubber bands. Just a bunch more office stuff like clips. Uh, sandpaper. It's all new. Edge Pro. Edge every time. Wow. What is this? Some gauze stuff. Rubber bands and... Yeah, this looks like one of those um, things that hold the phone in the car. That's what that is. Brandon, two of them might use this one because ours falls a lot. I think I've been teasing you guys enough with the large box. I meant to go through it last time, but as you can understand, got just a little distracted and wanted to get out of here. So let's see what's in this big box so we can get it out of our way. Because I have an idea based on its size and I'm hoping my idea is wrong. And well, it's not wrong. Is it a mattress or box spring? It's a brand new box spring. Okay. And it's not brand new. It's got stains on it right there. So it's a used box spring. So it's probably trash to be honest because trying to get rid of a bed out of a storage unit is like you got to pay people to take them you got to get lucky like that so we'll try to list it for free but most likely it'll probably go to the dump so maybe somebody in the comments can help me know what this is used for a dual drum rotary rock tumbler what what does it do mm. hmm. that what get smooth polished rocks oh okay know, maybe well, that's kind of cool. This one just says upstairs. So let's see what's up there. What you got upstairs? You got a gun upstairs. And you got some paper upstairs. Ew, this is all bathroom stuff and cleaner. Mm. Literally. Laundry detergent. It's two things of laundry detergent. I mean, hey, might as well use them, right? Yeah. We'll take them home, shoot. So this is supposed to be a new filing cabinet, but <laughs> we don't trust new no more here. <laughs> Oh, especially when it's like that. Yeah. Where's the door at? Front. Oh. Over here. Okay. This one might actually be new. Ow! Styrofoam. See? <laughs> you thought you could hide that from me. So these are the kind of people like I need to feel under the drawers. Make sure there's no like taped envelopes or nothing. <laughs> okay. This filing cabinet is actually new. Let's just move it in the truck. So we just moved the most like disgusting box of rotting. I don't even want to know what, but it was so disgusting. It literally even leaked through to this box, but this thing looked kind of interesting. So I just want to make sure there's nothing in it. But look at that box right there. That's just disgusting. That's what was on top of it. So let's just make sure there's nothing in there. Cause that looks like it could be like a, to me it looks like a jewelry box yeah. on top of your dresser. Maybe it's got all those, oh, oh my God, why? Why did it have to leak on that? I don't know, that's nice. There's a little card for it. It's like literally, nice and brand new can you even get to the other sections yeah never used check the bottom section like i said i don't trust nothing in here anymore no nope literally brand new jewelry box is pretty much ruined because whatever it is leaked on it that sucks look at this little box it says pete shoe dryer is that a such thing a shoe dryer uh is that what a shoe dryer looks like i guess i don't know what a shoe dryer is let's just set that box right here and grab the next one by the way can you see this instrument case now, like right there. I can't tell if it's a guitar, violin, banjo, or what it is. Maybe it's a rifle, I don't know. But I definitely want to get into that soon. Let's get this big mannequin guy out of here. Whoa, so the price tag on it. Look at that, $289.99. So almost a $300 mannequin. Apparently it can change size. It can change its bust and its hips. So maybe that's still value, something like that. I have no idea, but that's pretty cool because it's in the box. Just the box is just, you know, a little smushed. This box got a little ruined by whatever was leaking out of that gross box too, but let's cut it open and see what's inside of it. Hopefully something cool. Ooh, like looks like sewing patterns. So we got, yeah, I think that's what it is. Got some tape stuck to it, but yeah, these shirts are patterns. What is this, leather? So a bunch of leather pieces at the bottom. Whoa, a lot, the whole bottom's leather. Whenever this, they tried to make multiple of it. Yeah, they, so they sure made a lot of them. I wonder what it's like use is. It's weird. Somebody in the comments knows they should let us know, but it looks like a bunch of sewing stuff. Let's see if the computer box is that actually what's inside of it. It's really heavy. So if it's a computer, it's probably an older one. Inspected by Best Buy. So it's probably bought it uh, pre-owned. Like open box. People. What? Like open box. Yeah, Best Buy. that's what I meant. Cause it says inspected by on the tape. Is this new too? Like seriously? Hold on. Look over here. This is the keyboard and wire. Yeah, look. It's new. I mean, it's unused. 
<laughs> so the problem with computers is though it's probably that awkward age where nobody's gonna want it because it's got let's check it out it's got an i5 processor it's 64 bit six gigs of ram so one terabyte hard drive yeah it's actually pretty good All this right. might actually sell for a decent little amount right there i'm happy with it this is another art box but we don't know what that means but before i open it guys Make sure you take this two seconds and leave this video a thumbs up and of course hit the subscribe button if you're new because this unit has been our best ever in years of doing this. Hundreds of storage units. This is the best one ever. Let's see what's in the art box. Hey. <laughs> it's this fancy thing that everybody thinks of when they think of artist. Paint on the thing. I can't even think of the name of it. Yeah, I don't know. The name what's in this little box? Painting supplies. Let's get that out. This is drawing pencils. And these are some canvases, or yeah, a couple canvases. Graphite drawing kit. What's this guy? Head strap magnifier with light. Okay, okay. I don't know how that's used in art, but all right. Ooh, look at this Calvin Klein box at the bottom. Let's see what's in there. It's def definitely not Calvin Klein. What is this? That's heavy. Oh, it looks like all little crafting stuff. Yeah, just a bunch of crafting stuff. We don't need this box. We'll just leave it in the Calvin Klein box and set it over here. Then we got what? Paintbrushes right there. Looks paint like brushes. more paintbrushes. And the bottom thing is paint. Well, when they said art, I guess that was the best way to describe the box. I agree. Little box right here with no label. No, I think it says art. Art again. All right. So let's see if that's what's in there. Can you just cut already? Thank you. Oh my gosh, cut. Oh my goodness, just cooperate with me. What are these? It's a lot of whatever these Not are. Not art. Uh, what is this? <laughs> is it like, I mean, is it actually like container for it? I don't think there's anything in here. Planting instructions. Yeah, maybe they kept it for that reason. All right, so this is probably, okay, never mind. There's some stuff under, some Christmas lights. What's this? Filter. Filter in a glass bowl. All right, I don't think this one was art. The other one, I agree. This one, you lying. Check this thing out right here. I just scooted it over. This is a Performance Ream electric point of use water heater that seems like it's still in the box. Maybe not, because obviously they could have used the box for something else. So let's cut it open and see if that's what it is. It looks sealed to me. What do you think? Oh no, I guess- There's no tape. Okay. Um, is there any like handles where you can look inside? No. So I mean, we pretty much have to cut it open, unfortunately. I mean, you uh, just pull it, there's no tape. Yeah, look, it's new. If I can get this off. Jeez, it's that like government FBI cardboard. There it is. It's brand new, still in the box, never used. Like almost everything we found in this unit so far. This is a first for me. Look at this. A chicken egg incubator. Circulated air incubator watt automatic egg turner. So is this thing meant to like keep the eggs alive or is it meant to cook them or what's to it actually do? actually like hatch baby chickens. Okay, so these people, like I said, this is something that would probably be really cool in a survival situation because then, you know, you have a bunch of chickens with just some eggs. So I guess that's pretty cool. What it's worth now, I have no idea. I've never even seen something like this in person. So that's strange. I got a question for you. When do you think the next time we're gonna have to buy napkins and paper towels? A year from now? Maybe? Like, it's crazy <laughs> how many brand new napkins, paper towels, and toilet paper are in this unit. But, you know, it's one of those things where it's not worth a lot, but it's like, hey, I don't have to buy it now. All right. Let's see what's in this. Ooh, it says Disney frame or something. Inverse frame display. Oh, well, that's a lie. This is just clothes in there, unfortunately. They're like a blanket Dang use it. thing. I was hoping for Disney. This right here is one of the coolest things I was happy about seeing once we uncovered it. It's one of those outdoor canopies, 10 feet by 10 feet instant. So this, it's wind tested too. Ooh, so it's not gonna get blown away. <laughs> this is definitely something we're gonna keep for our house when we get it this year. So that's awesome. All right, let's try to get this big old crock pot down. This box, I can't believe I'm about to say this, actually looks retaped. Yeah. We might have found something that's not new so far. Let's cut it open and see if that's what's actually in there. Eh. It's, used. Yeah, it's used this time around, but it's still in good shape and still in the box, so we'll take that. What else should I get down? This big box here? I yeah. want to be able to reach that. I want to know what's in there. If it's like a guitar, a banjo, a violin, or whatever it is. I want to know. Let's get this big box right here down. Whoa, it's heavy. Whoa. 
All right, let's up. Oh, where'd the knife go? Here it is. We lost it. I got it. I got it. I'm a professional. <laughs> I think I'm the furthest thing from a professional. Like if there's a spectrum of professional and not professional, I'm all the way on the other side. And you know what? I'm proud of it. Let's see. Hey, we got ACT for dummies. Uh, this is a weird box here. Let me tell you. Got some papers. Cambridge Corporation. Okay. Hey, some diapers. Yeah, I needed these. Uh, what is that? A bead palette. What's a bee palette? Uh, you make necklaces on it. Hey, look, a 50-inch tripod. Nice. That's that's still in there. We'll take that. Tripod. We always need tripods. Yeah. Hey, look. Whoa. A big old box of gallon bags. Yay. <laughs> we never have to buy nothing for our kitchen in like a year. I'm gonna set that aside because that'll probably just go in our kitchen. Yeah. What else is in here? What are these guys? Let's see if I can open the red box under the bowls. So we got some. Big bowls. Giant metal bowls, yeah, they're huge. All right, let's put them back in there. I want to know what's in here. That's all right. What do you think it is? Mm, hopefully not tool. Paint. I would rather have tools than paint. <laughs> so I'm just gonna put that back in here. And other than that, there's another easel, and there's like a can of paint right there. So that was a really random box to say the least. Just to let you know, patience not my strong suit. So I have to know what's in this like now okay we'll get that down I, need to, I feel like i should grab something else hey look you'll be happy remember how you just had bought one of these hey dad mm -hmm. look at that right after you but you know if you didn't buy it this would have dematerialized so oh, it's I'm okay sure. this would have disintegrated and would have never been in the unit <laughs> there are so many boxes up here like holy crap Good. that's it let's see if i can get down without killing myself all right what's in the case let's i'm see. curious now it's like a little miniature guitar Open. I Open. I read the top. What? What does it say? Oh, ukulele? Yeah. Look at that little thing. Look how tiny it is. Ukulele. What is in good shape? And it's, uh, let's see, it's got the books. The case looks really nice. Like, this might actually be more expensive than I'm thinking. It's a Kala, K A L A band, probably pronouncing that wrong. But inside it says model number K A dash. S S L N G. Hey, need a new mop bucket? No. Well, it's new in the <laughs> box. What about like the 74 storage shelf was found in this unit? That was cool. That was little. This one's a mini one, yeah. The other ones have been a lot bigger, but hey, another storage shelf. Literally, I think it's actually like the six or seven. Which one? Well, any of them. Most of those. Uh, right one. Right one. All right. Let's see. I want to see what's in that black bag now. Everything makes me curious. Everything that's <laughs> different than everything else. What does that say? Uh, Wilton. Wilton Dust R Shots. What? I don't know. Let's see what that means. That doesn't help me at all. Um, all right. Papers. All right, let's see. What are those guys? And they're like closet organizers. Oh, oh yeah. Yeah, closet organizer thing. A lot of them too. Look Those at that. Those are things that goes in the cube shelves. Yeah. Oop. There's a cake decorator. Closet. What does that mean? Is that, <laughs> is that what it's called? Stuff like layer over a cake. Look at that queen sheet set. <laughs> what is this guy? Are these two guys? Southern living. Just little coffee cups. I'm guessing the other things. Probably the same thing. It is. Two of the same thing. So again, just a bunch more random, brand new stuff. As I said, it, I'm very impatient. Ooh, I have to know what's in the black bag. It came out a lot easier than I thought it would. What's it dangling from it? Can't tell. Uh, not really sure. Something. Something. Let's see what's in the black bag. What are these? What is that? Window ins insulation kit. All right. Under all that, what are, is this? Is that like an oxygen tank down there? You see it? Right there? I don't know. That's what it looks like to me. What is this? Some of the stuff I found in this unit this time around. A Phoenix backpacker. No idea. Look inside of it. We're gonna need help, guys. Yeah, we are. What is that? I have no idea. Let's see. And we got a pan and pot thing. Something you would take like camping or... Yeah, that's what I'm getting too. Like since they were like survivalist stuff, just stuff like that. 
Yeah, so maybe a bunch of camping stuff, but to tell you the truth, I have no idea. Another Lowe's box. This has upstairs pittance or pee items. What is pee items? No idea. That's what I'm saying. Gosh, cut. All right. What are pee items? Painting, probably. Let's try to think with this person. Hangers. This box is just for you. Look. This is like some of the worst ones, too. <laughs> this, it's brand new. Oh, look. A little. Oh, nothing in it. This is like perfect for you. What's this? What is that? A brand new pack of sunscreen. But we don't want that. I know what you really want is all the hangers oh, in there. Yeah. Your favorite. Merry Woo! Christmas. I got another Lowe's box right here. All I'm asking for is a box of ammo or another safe of money. It's not much, right? Jeez, now this looks like sewing patterns again. Whoa, a lot of them. Oh no, there's a bunch of boxes under these. Let's see what we got going on here. Uh-oh, I don't know if I want to open that. Bathroom drawer female. Let's see what's in this. This better not be the fun bag. No, nope, makeup. Okay. Every unit has a fun bag, guys. If you're thinking into buying storage units, just know every unit has a fun bag. And it's not fun for you. It's just fun for the former person that had it. What's in here? Cleaning supplies. Yeah. What about this one? Yeah. More bathroom. This whole box looks like it's going to go to the trash out there now. All right. You leave me no other choice. What's in there? Oh, see, they tried to fool me. There's jewelry in here. Look at that. There's jewelry and some other bathroom stuff. So we'll keep this box aside. What about the other one that says females? Ugh. That was my phone. Ugh. Goat milk soap and pads, Neutrogena. Yeah, okay, I don't know about all this stuff. All the used like bathroom stuff will go to the trash, but we'll keep that and look at the jewelry. You thought all the money was over, but no, 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 no. Look what she just found, and what was it, a card, right? Found 150 and one card, still going through the rest of them or whatever, there's a rack of them in here. You know what, if we wanna throw that filing cabinet away, we would've lost $50, <laughs> so you know what? It's only 50, but hey, what did we find last time? 27 something? <laughs> so I'll take 50 bucks too. Well, I'm in a good mood now. It just got re-exciting. Really this tote is sealed, that bug stuck in the tape. What a way to go. <laughs> all right, let's see what's in this tote. Hey, look. Oh, it's not in there. That is a camera flash, but it's not in there. Some junk. What is that? Fragile handle with care. We should use this for the post office because they're like, what's that say? Fragile with care. I right, put that in the other section. <laughs> what does that one say? Extremely breakable. No, I didn't want to throw that. Extremely breakable. Please handle with care. <laughs> yeah, that's how it always ends up when it gets there. Orchard food. Is this all like farming stuff? Mic keeper? I don't know either. <laughs> Some stuff, some seeds. So this is basically a bunch of farming stuff and a bunch of like decorative plants in there. We got another box that says it's upstairs. So let's see what's in the upstairs one. It's like a very, I don't know, like it's so undescriptive. Cause that could be anything upstairs. I like those ones. Ooh, is that Zale's the diamond store bag? What do we got in here? A bunch of clothes tags, really? <laughs> really? Those aren't diamonds. So let's see, little, what is that? Reusable hand warmers. You know, speaking of hand warmers, I just wanna let you know how Virginia is. Today, it's 66 degrees. Tomorrow, we're expecting five to eight inches. That's how our weather goes. Bipolar is you know what. Look, some pills. Want some pills? No. We can just take random pills out of the storage unit. Kidding, kidding. What is that? A llama. I thought it was a lamb. <laughs> <laughs> what else is in there? I see the light. Um, I see more yarn. Couple DVDs. Uh, let's scoot this stuff onto this side. This is the random junk junk drawer. Hey, a quarter! Hey. Yes, I found more money. Um, just more pills down there. What is that? Yeah, that's gonna be dentures, isn't it? I'm gonna open it. Oh, okay, they're not in there. All right. And then what is this? A big Bible? No. You young analytical coordinates to the Bible. Let's look through it. Everyone always tells me there's money in Bibles. If any unit's gonna have it, it would be this one. No, not this time. It'll happen one day, but it's not today. So if you remember last time, there was like a Keurig that was just kind of floating there. So, you know, I figured I'd take it down before it went boom. And this, we just opened it up, is actually just like everything else, surprisingly, brand new in the box, sealed, like everything else in this unit. Just the box is a little damaged, but you know, that's gonna go in the trash anyway, so who cares? Let's get this big old box here, if it'll cooperate with me. So we're gonna try to take this side all the way back to the wall so that we can kind of, you know, see this side. If there's anything hidden, I want to be able to see it. 
So this one's duct tape closed. Something's leaking. Is it like right now? No, I don't know if it's in this box or from another box though. Oh, okay. Let's cut all this duct tape. Duct tape's always harder to get through. Let's see what's in there. Oh, great. Hey, yeah, we'll take, whoa. A few things of trash bags. Are they new? They are. Big 18 gallon bags, yay! <laughs> These are, you, you have no idea. When you buy storage units, these are like finding gold. Right. You use these so much. Parmesan cheese, you know, I'll just take my own. What's in the top? That, it's like a cloth in there. That's not Parmesan cheese. What do you think's in there? I don't know, but just be wary because it might be something food related. All right, I'm going to open it, then I'm going to let you smell it. <laughs> I'm going to smell it. Smell it, guys. I don't know what's in there. I can't tell what's in there. Take oh, it out. Why? I don't want to take it out. It's gross. <laughs> Oh, never mind. Okay, I see seeds. So yeah, they're all seeds. <laughs> they're all seeds. I've seen it. Gross. More paper towels to add to our endless supply. Yep. What's this? Uh, oh, there it is. A the glass divider, divider kit. kit. All right. More bags. Look how many bags are in here. And more laundry detergent. One, two, three, four things of more bags. bags. <laughs> more laundry detergent. A food storage box. Brown paper bags. That was cringy, I know, sorry. Uh, three piece mixing bowl that's also brand new and randomly just some, what's it? Drawing paper. What the heck is that? Something's gross on the side of the box. I think it's just laundry detergent. Yeah, so hopefully the laundry detergent's still good, but hey, more new stuff we don't have to buy. I'll take that every day. Let's get the little box here and cut it open. It's to nobody from nobody. Nope. So sad. This poor box doesn't have a home. It does now. You can come home with us, maybe. Oh, I'll take the inside, too. Uh, what is in here? What's in the white box? That's interesting right there. Boxes and boxes. Well, what is that? Is this a spray? What's it say on the front of it? I can't see it. Me neither. I can't read it. Yeah, I can't read it either. Huh. Hopefully it'll be a lot more clear on video and you guys can read it. Ooh, no, it's just a rag. I thought that was like a bag of coins or something. There's a bracket. There's some DVDs. There is, hey, like a tablet keyboard. Maybe there's a tablet in here with it. Hopefully. Let's see. Is that what this is? Hey. That is what that is. Look at that. Cool. A nice little tablet. What brand is it? Insignia. So that's nice. Put that with the keyboard. Then we got some fabric and fabric and fabric all the way down but a lot of you guys have let me know in the past some of that sewing fabric can be worth a lot of money so we'll definitely look into it i got another lowe's box how many boxes they buy at lowe's a lot all of them yeah let's see that some sewing thing this is just a book that says plants on it all right whoa that's okay. a lot of writing and this is just two it is it's just two Giant packs of jars that are brand new. Eleven dollars a pack, so twenty dollars worth of jars. Again, with all the new stuff, it's just it, it's so strange. Mo's box right here. Another one. This is the last one on the floor. Look, we've actually made a pretty good indention on this side. Sure have. I'm gonna go all the way to the wall on this side, like I said. Let's see. Open up. Let's see what's inside. Here you go. Tissues. Put those in the car or truck. Uh, fabric, little miniature planters. Let me put this knife over here so we don't lose it. This looks like more crafting type stuff. To gash that all tool, maybe not. I don't think that's for crafting. Well, that bag didn't last. Look in there. It's so many random little tools. And I don't want to just go through it all right now. But again, guys, subscribe to the second channel down in the description below. We'll go through a lot of this stuff, a lot more detail, so you can see every last little item. Do it now. Go. Let's see what's in the smushed box here. It says bicycle on it. Do you think a bike will fit in there? Maybe. Fold up. That would be a one heck of a folding bike if it fit Hold in that up. box. Let's see. I'm guessing bike equipment probably. Get off. All right. Yeah, I see helmets. There's helmet. Oh. Oh, no. I thought that was a pistol case. Dang it. That's great. I love random leaks inside the unit that you have no idea what it is and it gets on your hand. You're like... Maybe this is poison, maybe it's not. Cross your fingers. Uh, yeah, it looks like it's just a bunch of biking equipment. Stuff for your helmet, stuff to wear, gloves, pants, things like that. So, bike stuff. Remember at the beginning of this video, I said I had something interesting to show you? Well, let me show you that really quick before we go. So this is a piece of paper that was found inside the safe. It's folded up because it has a lot of personal information on it, but 
It has one little cool thing that caught my attention right here. We're not gonna go into too much detail, but as you can see, that is a combination to the gun safe and how to unlock it. Now, is that gun safe in the unit? I don't know, but what I do know is we sure have a lot more boxes and a lot more space to go in there. So, fingers crossed, we're gonna find that thing because we already found a safe of money and a safe of guns will just be the cherry on top of this crazy unit. So don't forget to like the video, subscribe if you're new, and until next time, peace out.